Hello everyone. Nice to meet you all. I'm Min Young Han, the Winter and Summer Program Coordinator at Yonsei University. I'm so happy to be here to introduce the Yonsei International Summer School Program. For short, we call it EAST. Before we move on, let me show you a short video about Yonsei University. The video explains pretty much why Yonsei University is special and why you should choose the EAST program for your journey this summer. You can see our beautiful campus with academic excellence. Our teaching staff is attentive. Yonsei is in the center of Seoul, so you can enjoy diverse activities outside of school as well. About the campus, Ever since Yonsei University was founded in 1885, it has been the most prestigious of universities. It has many historical buildings, but also modernized facilities. It also has the biggest university library in Korea. As I mentioned about the location beforehand, you will mainly stay on the Sinchon campus. <clears throat> which is the center of Seoul. This is the best place to be. It is the epic center of popular youth culture. And from there, you can access many historical and cultural landmarks in Seoul in just 30 minutes. Okay. Let's move on to the East 2022. Now, this is the general information about the East. First of all, let me tell you about the eligibility. We are open to most students in the world. All college and university students can apply for the East. High school seniors also can apply as long as they can show us their college or university acceptance letter. We require a minimum 2.0 GPA. As you can see in our academic calendar, there are two types of programs in the, in the EAST program. One is a four-week program and the other is a six-week program. They are all going to begin on the same day, on June 28th. The four-week program will end on July 21st and the six-week program will end on August 4th. We provide on-campus housing the check-in date is six days before the starting day, and check-out is the day after the final day. Okay, about the application process, it's already open and ongoing. The application deadline is May 13th, don't miss out. There are two course registration dates. One thing to consider before you apply is that there is an early bird weird. I will tell you about it more later. Anyway, the first registration period from April 28th to 29th will be exclusive for Olive Bird Reward recipients only. This will be a great chance for you to register for the competitive courses you want to take. This means you can reserve the courses you want without worrying about them filling up. The general course regis registration period is May 30th to May 31st. Of course, we can't forget the tuition fee and scholarships. You can refer to this chart for the tuition fee and the application fee. When you apply for the EAST, you need to pay the application fee so that we can take your documents and make the admission decision. There is a very special reward this year. The early bird reward is 
for students who apply by April 22nd. This reward is pretty generous to everyone. Once you finish your registration, we will deduct 300,000 Korean dollar from your total tuition fee with the early course registration chance I mentioned previously. Also, there are various scholarships in needs. You can take a look here and you can also check our website to get all the info you need. One more thing that I want to highlight is the Scholastic Award, which will be given after the course grading. If you, if you perform well in your classes and get an A plus from more than one course, you will get a scholarship. As you can see, it's not a small amount of money. It's going to be a big benefit for you. About the courses. I tried my best to include as many courses here as possible, but we'd offer so many that I couldn't put them all. The full course catalog has been updated on our website, and you're always welcome to check it out to see the courses we'll offer this summer. There are both the four-week and six-week pro six programs, and all the details are available there. There are seven academic fields plus an internship program. We are aiming to hold the EAST program in person, but we also offer online-only courses for those who cannot come to Korea. Please refer to the highlighted courses. I can tell that most of you guys are interested in the internship course. The internship will be a two-credit course on a pass non pass basis. If you want to apply for the internship, you must be already registered. Also, please be aware that students need to take one course in addition, more than one course in addition to the internship course. The application period for the internship will be from April 4th to April 22nd. There are two types of internships. One is research and the other is corporate. With a research internship, you can join an actual study or research from the professors or specific research center in Yonsei University. As for the corporate internship, we will work in a Korean company and you will be able to get practical and professional experience from it. Orientation is on June 16th and the internship runs from June 17th to August 4th. Internship participants will work for 3.5 hours every Monday to Thursday, either in the morning or the afternoon. It will depend on the companies and organizations, so please visit our website for more information. This is about on-campus housing. The housing fees are shown for your information. You can see the campus is very big, but convenient at the same time. This is the main gate, and this is the SK Global House where the summer international students usually stay. About the activities, we are planning to offer various cultural extra and extracurricular activities this summer. They'll be related to Korean culture, like Korean cooking class, taekwondo class, and also we can join the Mud Festival, which is very famous and popular in Korea. Furthermore, we will visit old historical and cultural places like folk villages. So, this is the basic information about the East. If you have any questions, you can always reach us through email, website, phone call, or even social media. As for on-campus housing questions, you can reach out to SK Global House instead. Okay, everyone, thank you for listening and watching. I look forward to meeting you all this summer in Korea. Thank you.